Welcome to the one of the most beautiful weddings I've ever been a part of. I mean, look around. Look how beautiful it is to every detail. Firstly, I'd like to compliment the families, the Fawcett's, the Avin Coolest, for creating and raising such beautiful and magnificent people that we get to celebrate today. Before I give a toast, I also just want to really um, point out some people that I think that are really important to this day because it really wouldn't be Nicole and Sean's wedding without them. So I wanted a shout out to the bartenders! Nicole and Sean have a strong bond and love that many people dream of finding. On their way to a bonfire, they met through a mutual friend, George. I wasn't sure if I should bring up the first time that we had met, walking on the beach boulevard. So young, so naive, so unaware of the journey we were getting ready to take. I don't know what happened that day, but <laughs> Sean couldn't stop talking about you for days. You had him hooked. It's crazy to think we were 17 and 18 when we first met, not knowing what we were getting ourselves into. I remember asking you if you would ever date an Asian girl, and well, here we are. <laughs> Little did they know, that was the start of their wonderful life together. Now, they are each other's best friends and number one companions. Remembering all of the times that we had made it very easy for me to be able to write our vows. Over the years, I've seen you grow into a smart, beautiful, and confident woman. You always made me feel safe. You were my protector, and I always felt like you were the only one I could be myself around. That's why, when we broke up, a part of me felt like I lost myself. It was hard to go through that life feeling like my best friend wasn't there anymore. Losing you was probably one of the hardest things I had to go through because a part of me still loved you and wanted to be with you. But 
we both needed this time to work on ourselves. I'm grateful that God brought us back together, and even though we still had a lot of growing up to do, I was thankful to have you by my side. I vow to keep our walk close to God. I know that there's going to be a lot of things that are thrown our way, as long as we just kind of stay on the righteous path. I know that there's nothing that will come in our way. I don't think I tell you this enough, but I admire you so much. Through all the ups and downs we went through, by ourselves or with each other, you have always stayed true to yourself and always kept a positive outlook on everything no matter what you went through. I vow to be adventurous, explore the world, and try new foods with you, except for seafood, coffee, guacamole. <laughs> you kind of get the picture. Nicole and Sean, no matter what challenges you face, you now face them together. No matter how much you succeed, you now succeed together. I can't promise you that our love is going to be perfect, painless, or easy. But what I can promise you is that I'll never stop fighting for our love. I love you so much, Shondell Fawcett, and I can't wait to see what the future has in store for us. To Sean and Nicole, don't exist, live. <laughs> And so now, by the power vested in me, it is with great joy and delight to declare you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. Mr. and Mrs. Fawcett.